taught us. Um, way too many of those big innings have popped up against this, and they've, they've led to several of our losses. Uh, 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 Odorizzi was really good tonight. We talked about uh, going out there with a different game plan, and he did. You saw him mix all of his pitches extremely well. Um, 100 pitches. We, we messed up that one double play early on. He might have been able to go deeper into that game had we not done that. But I thought he was really good. I mean, the curveball is outstanding. to go with uh, well-located fastball, some really good uh, Cobb splits. Uh, he was good. And then, um, you know, Jake uh, bailed out uh, Boxy. And then I felt really good about Joel right there. But it just, again, and then eventually the home run by uh, Felix. Um, again, we, we, we just got to get past that uh, beginning uh, complex. Another tough night for Gomes, though. Two run homer last night, three run tonight. Yeah, you know, and I have so much faith and confidence in him. I really, again, you know, I, I talk about this often. I have, like, these predetermined setups, and I just really liked him against that part of the batting order, Gomes versus Gomes, and then Chisenhall, and then uh, uh, Avilas, and it just uh, did not play out. What's changed in Odorizzi confidence-wise out there? Is there something you're working on with him? Well, we just, we just talked uh, primarily, like I said, about uh, approach, uh, utilizing all of his weapons in a better manner as opposed to um, not. So we just talked about that at length, and I thought he did a nice job. And him and, and Hannigan did a good job with him, too. Another positive to Jesus. He keeps hitting. Yeah. yeah, he's been doing really well for probably the last, I don't know, maybe 10 days, something like that. He had a great night tonight, and it's, it's wonderful to see he's going to be a big part of our um, resurgence. Can you put it into perspective, even though it is four straight now, it's a really tight AL East race, and you're only a few games out of first. I know that's the part that's somewhat uh, salvageable through the whole moment because uh, we've lost these kind of games, and um, uh, we normally win these kind of games, and it's going to come back to us. I, and listen, I, it's a tough moment. I understand that. Uh, we don't like it. Nobody else likes it. Um, but we're going to come back, and we're going we're to be just fine. Um, uh, unable to get hits, we're going to start getting hits. Unable to make pitches, we're going to make start making pitches. Some of the gaps on defense, uh, we're going to we're going to pull that together too. We're, we're we're too good for that. Right now, it's about uh, you know a little bit of a patient process, be consistent with our approach with the players, and they're going to come back. Do you have an update on Escobar Singer? I have not. I, well, yeah, I think it was fine. I don't think there's anything seriously wrong with it. Escobar, right thumb, right thumb contusion, so he's going to be fine. Did he have X-rays? He did, and he was fine. Okay. Um, with the bullpen having to get so many outs, mm -hmm. uh, so early this year. Do you worry about them being overexposed this early? Always. Always do. Um, they have been. They've been out there often and um, uh, that's always a concern. I mean, I think one of our uh, strong points over the last several years is that we keep guys fresh for the end of the season. And a lot of, I mean, we've been off, we've gotten off to bad uh, starting pitching starts in the past, but this one's extended a little, not, not bad. I mean, it was a good start tonight. Just a not covering as enough innings like you would need to. And uh, with that, these guys have been extended a bit. Uh, but I honestly have so much confidence in all of them, and I think it's going to be a really, really, really very good bullpen by the end of the season. It's just uh, it's tough getting all the pieces together right now. And how do you balance with Peralta? He's had a couple of really rough outings, uh, not so much in a row, but he's had three out of four uh, outings that have been... Uh, that have been tough, but I know he wants to pitch more. I know oh no, he's no, he's he's fine. I mean, that part of the thing tonight was I wanted I didn't want him to throw too many pitches tonight, and I had him slotted for four hitters, and that was um, from Brantley, uh, Brantley, Santana, Murphy, and Cabrera. That's what I had him, and then I had Gomes written right here before the game began, and Gomes on Gomes, and so there it was. So, uh, in, in a perfect world, um, Joel is going to go an inning and a third right there. And then Gomes is going to get the bottom part and then come back to Balfour. That's why we had it set up, and it just uh, didn't play.